Yo, what's up guys? This is the rarest item on Roblox. The Lady of the Federation currently has zero items for sale and on Rollymons, there's currently zero available copies zero premium copy. So there's actually no way you can actually get this item, making it the rarest item on Roblox. For a long time it was believed that this item was completely removed from Roblox and that there were zero copies left. Through accounts getting terminated and copies getting deleted through different ways, all of the copies of this item actually ended up getting deleted. As you can see here, it originally sold a total of 10 times for 250,000 Robux. But I do believe there are two copies of this item on accounts with hidden inventories that are definitely not for trade. This is part of the Federation collection which definitely has some of the rarest items on Roblox. The Lord of the Federation also originally only had 10 copies when it came out. But it's still not as rare as the Lady of the Federation which only has 2 copies left. This item came out on January 23rd of 2015 so it's not even like it's a super old item either. It's 7 years old but compared to some other items that's not even too bad. For example the Lord of the Federation came out on March 8th of 2012 which is 3 years old. Older. And Dominus Imperius came out on January 24th of 2010. And both of those two items still have a decent amount of copies left. So that asks the question of what makes the Lady of the Federation so rare? If it's newer than these other items, why is it more rare than them? And if you're wondering why it is so rare, I believe it's because there was one guy who owned a few copies of them who actually got terminated with it. On rblx.trade, you can see all the people who got banned with it. And you can see right here this guy actually owned two of them and he got banned with both. The number 3 serial and the number 6 serial. As well as a bunch of other people who also got banned with this item. And this item still does have a couple of copies left but like I said earlier, for a long time people actually thought that this item had zero copies left. But that's actually never happened to a Roblox item before. There's never been a limited item that has zero copies left, besides a few limited items which never actually released or were glitches, like the Evil Skeptic face, which is like the second version of the Evil Skeptic. I don't know what the difference is, I don't think there even is one. For some reason there's just two copies of this item. And then you also have the fake Chartreuse Parasteron Gamma, which has zero copies, no one has ever owned this item, no one will ever own it, which is a fake version of the Chartreuse Parasteron Gamma which is another pretty rare item. So yeah, besides these items which never actually released, there hasn't been any limited item which has actually gotten down to zero copies. So I'm actually really curious what would happen if there was an item that got to zero copies, if Roblox would re-release it, or if that item would just be deleted and no one would ever own it again. Personally, I think it would be really cool if they decided to re-release items like that, where they just drop them for the original price again, for however many copies, and let people just get it. But I don't think that will ever happen. But if it does, I would be really curious to see what Roblox would do. I'm currently trying to hit 100,000 subscribers before the end of the year. So I'd really appreciate it if you guys would leave a like and subscribe to the channel. It would really help me out and help me reach that goal. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed. Peace.